So Betty Michi, I'm Kai Sunubus, and welcome back to Assassin's Creed. Last time we went to Damascus, and, well, besides the missions we did around there, we took out the Merchant King. And we found out a vital uh, bit of important information from our boss that all those people that we've killed thus far are, at least according to him anyway, they're Templars. So, that definitely gives some greater context as to what we are dealing with. But no matter, we will continue on as we have until the end. So, without further ado, let's get into it, shall we? How is Lahanam doing? Good, good, I am glad. Alright. Out we go. Someone's gonna stop us? Good. Your mother! Anyway. Well, that's an interesting pose. Alright, Jerusalem! I don't know what you were saying, nor do I care. Alright, is this where Sourpuss is? Yes, it is. Safety and peace, Malik. Where that the city was possessed of either. Why do you trouble me today? Al Muallam has marked Majduddin for death. What can you tell me about him? Salahuddin's absence has left the city without a proper leader, and Majduddin has appointed himself to play the part. Fear and intimidation get him what he wants. He has no true claim to the position. That ends today. You speak too readily. This is not some slaver we're discussing. He rules Jerusalem and is well protected because of it. I suggest you plan your attack carefully. Get to better know your prey. With your help, I will. Where would you have me begin my search? What's this? You're actually asking for my assistance instead of demanding it. I'm impressed. Be out with it. As you wish. Here's where I would look. First, to the southwest near the mosque. After that, head south of here. There are two locations that might interest you. The southernmost church is one, the other is in the streets, near a synagogue. Thank you for your help, Dari. Don't foul this, Altair. Okay. I won't. Alright, well, off we go. So... Huh, true. I guess Jerusalem... I guess Jerusalem isn't that big either. Alright, off to the point we go. Ah, what a fool. Ah! There's no... I don't understand what he's trying to accomplish. I am trying to accomplish getting from A to B, you simpleton. Anyway, uh. Infidel! Woo! Where are you hiding? I'm hiding in your mother! Shit, 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 no! No! You son of a bitch! Oh, dirty little skate. What? What? Huh? 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 What do you want? What do you want from me? 
Oh! Oh, yourself! Anyway. Okay. My presence? That will cost you your life! Help me! Somebody help me! Help me! Somebody help me! That will cost you your life! Let go of me! I've done something wrong! You dare steal in my presence? Oh dear! What are you doing? Oh dear! What am I doing? Thief! No! You are filthy! Dirty thief! I'll have your hand for that. No. What is he doing? Please, I've done. Oh! Why are you doing this? Stop this, please! You're hurting me. Don't hurt me, please. Heretic! Oh. No, you don't understand. I have nothing. Please, anyone! There's nowhere to run, old man! No! Oh, please! You're hurting me! Oh, Rabban, what? Please! 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 Oh, nest. Thank you, boy. I only wish my son were half as brave as you. I'll see to it that they hear this tale and know what it is to be a true hero. Oh, what it is to be a true hero? Who would have done such a thing? Such a shame. What? What happened? <laughs> Okay, oh. Wow. That's kind of small and insignificant. Cool. All right. Poor district. Trespass here. Hey, it's a church. Be quiet. My second year of the chance through is it was. Well, well, who we have here? Okay. Um, 
They have my son? What is to be done with him? We did everything we could. What is to be done with him? He's to be executed. Today. No. I won't allow it. But what can we do? Majduddin will hear no appeals. He says there can be no barter with God's will. This is not God's will, but madness. I'll go to him myself. Where is he? He will attend the execution. Perform it even. He enjoys the act. Truly evil man. We have no time to lose then. Let's go. Uh. Oh no. Wait, it's right there. Ah! There we go. No further. Oh. Did you see the order? He wants us to repair a stage for another execution today. It's the one at the western edge of Solomon's temple. I was on my way just now. So much death. Were it? That our true leader might return and bring a measure of justice to this city. Yes, and not this mockery Majdadeen parades before us. How? How does something like this happen? Everyone appointed in Salah Hadin's stead is met with an untimely end. And now the position falls to him. He, who was once nothing more than the Emir's scribe. How convenient. It would not surprise me to learn he was behind these accidents. Shh. If the guards hear us, we'll be taken for treason. Executed on the very platform we have to repair. Come, let us return to work. No reason to stand here, please. No. Come on. Has always been ours. 
And it is our duty to defend it until death. The Crusaders must be destroyed! Curse him! Curse the Christian king and his army of infidels! Right. They go against the will of God and must be made to pay! Everywhere they rise, there is only suffering in their wake. They say it is a crusade! A crusade for what? Ignorance? Violence? Madness! We must raise it! We must fight them in any way we can! Oh! Okay. And now... Hello, Tim Clark. Sorry. Oh, shine with you. Damn. Call the whole fucking city There we go. Okay. Damn. Cool. Nice. Save you, whether you like it or not. Oh, God! Oh, God, fucking damn it. 
No, 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 Jesus Christ. What? We defaulted on our debt. The fuck you mean we defaulted on our debt? We defaulted on our fucking debt. I thought the Treasury took care of that last month. No, I, uh, I kind of forgot. You see, there was this balloon. Joe, we have no more fucking money. Sure we do. Uh, what about, uh, what about the $2.3 trillion were buried in the Rockies before we did 9-11? We spent it all. On what? Afghanistan. Fuck, what about, oh God, what about the kids? You know, the fucking child sex slave trade we took over after killing Epstein? The Clintons sold it to Chinese firms. Bill kept a few of the kids, of course. God damn it. Okay, get Israel on the phone. It's time for the Samson option. Shit. <laughs> damn. All right, back to it. Whoopsie daisy. <laughs> Holy shit! Alright, cool. Good you came along when you did. Another minute and they would have made off with you. Next one to say. I mean, we sort of said. seem to have it in for me. Every time I leave here, I'm attacked and forced to flee. I'm simply not the fighter I once was. Would you be willing to see me safely to my destination? Sure. Infidel! You will die here! Ah, ah. Leave 
speak now and I let you live. The fires of war consume the land, and thousands of lives are lost in its defense. In this tragedy, what I say is You're a dead man. To die in ah! Oh! Ah! Put that arm off of me! Come on, Spill blood in front of a holy place. In the chaos, I managed to grab this from one of the guards. Perhaps it'll be of use to you. Huh. And he does. 
Thomas, I won't help you. I've got a You frighten me. Why are you doing this to me? I've done nothing wrong. This is the capital. Oh, oh, no, among you who defy the law. We are nothing without our faith, without its rules and its direction. To defy it is to defy the one who leads us. Such behavior cannot be allowed. Okay. I'd like to say a few words. Uh, thank you. No, or I'll make you keep your distance. <laughs> you 
pay for that. Enough. I still breathe, so you must desire more than just my life. What is it? You know Mejduddin well? Better than most. He seems a bit too righteous. Is the law really so important to him? What do you think? I think he hides something, and I think you'll tell me what it is. It's a veil. All of it. Men like me, we are meant to scare them, fill the people with fear. The ones he kills, not criminals, but dangerous all the same. Dangerous to who? His plans. Their plans. Yes, he speaks of others. Those he works with. Works for, perhaps. I am uncertain. They need the city, though. Controlling it is important to them. Why? You'll have to ask him yourself. Attend one of his executions. It's when he's most talkative, addressing the crowd, hands covered in blood. Then we are done. <laughs> Supposed to be here, me. Look, look. you dare to kneel in my presence? That will cost you your life. Your presence will Right. Safety and peace. I'm so glad to see you. In these troubled times, they asked me to prove myself. But I feel so inadequate when I compare myself to you. I must kill two of Mujduddin's men without a fight. Could you show me the way? I will be forever grateful and share a very interesting story with you. I wonder if he's hurt. Really? Double 
Damn it! I fell right at the end. How the fuck am I not able to beat him? Closer. I need food. I'm so hungry. Just a little money, I beg of you. Motherfucker. Go the fuck away. Could you spare a few coins? clan has ever seen. Here is my story, Master. I was cleaning the temple steps. I overheard two scholars praising how easy it was for them to pass the soldiers guarding the entrance of the execution plaza. If you time your entry properly, they could provide a nice distraction for the guards. But I am sure that with your wisdom, you knew that already. Okay. Well, one more place to go, and then uh, we can deal with our target. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> okay. 15, 14. Aha. Uh -huh. <laughs> We have found the strength to stand in defense of our great civilization. Make no mistake, it is our very existence we are fighting for. The infidel king would see us all wiped from the world. We must resist. We must push back. All right. There we go. Geronimo! Off we go to home. You've something to say? Before it has a chance to begin! That's the Christian king and his army of infidels! They go against the will of God and must be made to pay! 
What news, novice? I am not a novice. A man's skill is defined by his actions, not the markings on his robe. We can trade barbs or do Al Muallim's work. It's your decision. Then be out with it. Jerusalem's regent Mejduddin is holding a public execution not far from here. It's sure to be well guarded, but it's nothing I can't handle. I know what to do. And that is why you remain a novice in my eyes. You cannot know anything, only suspect. You must expect to be wrong, to have overlooked something. Anticipate, Altair. How many times must I remind you of this? As you wish. Are we done? Not quite. There is one more thing. One of the men to be executed is a brother. One of us. Al Mulim wishes for him to be saved. Do not worry about the actual rescue. My men will take care of that. But you must ensure Majduddin does not take his life. I won't give him the chance. So I hope. Fast forward in memory to a more recent one.
among you. They saw the seeds of discontent, hoping to lead you astray. Tell me, is this what you desire? To be mired in deceit and sin? To live your lives in fear? Then you wish to take action? Your devotion pleases me. This evil must be purged. Only then can we hope to be redeemed. This is not justice. You know all right to do that. Who do you take yourself for? And all of you stand idle, complicit in this crime. Don't curse you all! <laughs> See how the evil of one man spread to corrupt others? They sought to instill fear and doubt within you. But I will keep you safe. Here now are four filled with sin. The harlot, the thief, the gambler, the heretic. Let God's judgment be brought down upon the all! <laughs> Temptress! Succubus! Oh. She goes by many names. <laughs> Come on. All right. Your work here is finished. No, no, it had only just begun. Tell me, what's your part in all of this? Do you intend to defend yourself as the others have and explain away your evil deeds? The Brotherhood wanted the city. I wanted power. There was an opportunity. An opportunity to murder innocents. Not so innocent. Dissident voices cut deep as steel. They disrupt order. In this, I do agree with the Brotherhood. You'd kill people simply for believing differently than you. Of course not. I killed them because I could. Because it was fun. Do you know what it feels like to determine another man's fate? And did you see the way the people cheered? The way they feared me? I was like a god. You'd have done the same if you could. Such power. Once perhaps. But then I learned what becomes of those who lift themselves above others. And what is that? Here, let me show you. Not even more like a 
Jerusalem needs a new ruler. So I have heard. What's this? No words of wisdom for me? Surely I have failed in some spectacular fashion. You performed as an assassin should. No more, no less. That you expect praise for merely doing as told, however, troubles me. It seems everything I do troubles you. Reflect on that. But do so on your way back to Masyaf. Your work here is done. Cool. Alright. Fast forwarding memory to a more recent one. Cool. Yeah, that guy was just no good. Say, Doc. I'm ending the session. No, I'll be right there. You're sure about this? Yes. No. Everything's Denver. I don't see how he could. Of course. I understand. You're in a lot of trouble, Mr. Miles. What's his problem? They're coming for you. Who's coming for me? Assassins. Hey, I had nothing to do with this. Sounds like they're mounting some kind of rescue attempt. Guess you're more important than you realized. Man, things just keep getting weirder and weirder around here. It was bound to happen. What do you mean? That little fight your ancestors started during the Third Crusade? It never ended. You're being held by Templars. Vidic's a Templar? There's no way you could have known. They hide it so well. But to answer your question, Vidic works for them. We all do. Abstergo is their company. I thought Templars were old dudes with funny hats who sat around drinking beer and plotting world domination with, like, the lizard people. No. Except the part about world domination, I guess. Look, Desmond, it's complicated. Half the stuff they say about the Templars comes from crazy tinfoil hat-wearing nutjobs. The other half is misinformation intentionally produced by the Templars themselves. But they are the bad guys, right? If there's one thing I've learned since I started working here, it's that there's no such thing. 
It's all so relative. I guess the best way to explain it is what they want is good, but the way they're going about it, it's bad. Really bad. What are they trying to do? Lucy? Yes. Miss Stillman, I need to speak with you. Get up here, now! On my way, Doctor. I'm sorry, Desmond, I have to go. You should turn in for the night. The answers to all of your questions are right in front of you. You just have to know where to look. Uh... I beg your pardon? So what then? Please, Desmond. I'm gonna get in trouble if I don't leave. And I can't leave until you're in your room. Okay, fine. Well... That's interesting. Take a nice long leak. No? Alright. How about a shower? Would a shower do you good? No, I guess not. I guess we like living on our stink. Wash your hands? No, I guess not. Alright, well, uh, I have no clue what's going on, but apparently I'm being rescued from upstairs. Go. No matter. This is where I am going to leave it here for this episode. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please be sure to like and subscribe. And until next time, this has been Kaiser Nubis. Valette!